hello friend welcome to my channel 5 minute pediatric today i will be discussing about how to treat chicken pox and herpes zoster so what antiviral drug is recommended for pediatric patient with uncomplicated varicella or chicken pox so the only antiviral drug available in liquid formulation that is licensed for pediatric use is acyclovir so according to american academy of pediatrics acyclovir is not recommended for the treatment of uncomplicated varicella in otherwise healthy children because of marginal benefit the cost of drug and lower risk of complication of varicella so when should treatment with acyclovir be initiated for uncomplicated varicella the answer is for better result we should initiate it as early as possible preferably within 24 hour onset of exanthem there is less clinical benefit if it is treated or if it is started beyond 72 hour of onset of exanthem now in which individuals it uh, acyclovir is recommended for the treatment of uncomplicated varicella so the oral acyclovir the dose is 20 mg per kg per dose maximum is 800 mg per dose given as four dose per day for five days can be used to treat uncomplicated varicella in individual at risk for development of moderate to severe varicella so the individuals include non pregnant individual more than 12 year of age and individual older than 12 month of age with chronic cutaneous or pulmonary disorder individual who are on short term intermittent or aerosolized corticosteroid therapy individual receiving long term salicylate therapy and possibly secondary cases among household contacts now what are the potential complication of varicella that may require iv therapy so iv therapy is indicated for severe diseases and for varicella in immunocompromised patient even if begin more than 72 hour after onset of rash any patient who having sign of disseminated varicella like pneumonia severe hepatitis thrombocytopenia encephalitis they all should receive iv acyclovir therapy and it should be initiated within 20 72 hour of development of initial symptom and uh, this will decrease the progression of varicella and varicellal dissemination in high risk patient so the treatment is continued for 7 to 10 days or until no lesion have appeared for 48 hour so which other drug beside acyclovir therapy may be used to treat varicella in older children who can swallow tablet so some expert recommend the use of famcyclovir or valacyclovir in children who can swallow tablet so these drug have similar mechanism as acyclovir and has better absorption by oral route than acyclovir so the dose of valacyclovir is 20 mg per kg per dose maximum is 1 g per dose and at given 3 times daily for 5 days is licensed for the treatment of varicella in children 2 to less than 18 years of age and both well acyclovir and famcyclovir are approved for treatment of herpes zoster in adult now few question and answer related to herpes zoster so what antiviral drug are effective for treatment of herpes zoster in healthy adult and how long is treatment typically prescribed so antiviral drug are effective for treatment of herpes zoster so include acyclovir uh, given uh, at a dose of 800 mg 5 times per day for 5 to 7 days famcyclovir is given 5 mg tid per oral for 7 days and well acyclovir 1 g tid per oral for 7 days these reduce the duration of illness and risk for development of post neural uh, post herpetic neuralgia so is treatment of uncomplicated herpes zoster in other by healthy children always necessary with an antiviral agent 
and why or why not so if the healthy children having herpes so the development of complication and post herpetic neuralgia usually does not occur therefore treatment of uncomplicated herpes zoster in children with antiviral agent may not be always be necessary although some expert would treat with oral acyclovir to shorten the duration of illness it is important to start antiviral therapy as soon as possible delaying beyond 72 hour from the onset of rash limits its effectiveness so what is the recommended oral dose of acyclovir for the treatment of uncomplicated herpes zoster in children so the treatment of uncomplicated herpes zoster in children with uh, antiviral may not be necessary although some expert uh, would uh, give a oral acyclovir to shorten the duration of illness what is the importance of uh, starting antiviral therapy for herpes zoster as soon as possible and what is the time frame for effectiveness start antiviral therapy as soon as possible delaying beyond 72 hours from the onset of rash limits its effectiveness so what is the recommended treatment of uh, for immunocompromised children with herpes zoster and why it is is it important for high risk patient to receive this treatment herpes zoster in immunocompromised children can be severe and disseminated the disease may be life threatening patient who are at risk for development of disseminated disease should receive iv acyclovir Oral acyclovir, femcyclovir, and valsac are, are are option for immunocompromised patient with the ampli, uh, uh, with uncomplicated zoster who are at uh, low risk for development of visceral dissemination. Neuritis with herpes zoster should be managed with appropriate analgesic. Use of uh, corticosteroid uh, for the treatment of herpes zoster is not recommended in pediatric patient. So these are the few question. Uh, that are frequently asked and uh, all of the pediatrician must know all the an uh, answer and should treat their patient accordingly hope so enjoyed this video kindly like subscribe and follow my channel thanks thanks for watching